Hello and welcome back. I'm Lawrence. In this tutorial today, we're going to fix the neck and we're going to find an animation image reference so that we can start animate our character here. First, we're going. I'm going to hide the head from here. Shift, click, click, and make a new folder. Rename this head and hide this. Select the body. Okay, the neck is fixed. Now we're going to find an animation reference from the Google. All we have to do is type in running sprite sheet and then you will find your sample. Let's find this one. I'm going to pick this one. So go ahead and save this on your desktop and go back to your photoshop and open it alright, here we're going to cut all of this image we have 10 image here we're going to make them in separate layers so we must have 10 layers on each one of them And once you complete uh, crop them one by one, you should have ten layers like this, which represent every each of them. See? So let's arrange the number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then we have to put this, we have to arrange this so that we can check the animation. We start with number one and then number two. Number three and so on. And once you complete, arrange them, you should have something looks like this one so from here let's go ahead click window and timeline now we have one timeline here but before before we create more timeline i suggest you hide all of this first then we create 10 timeline because we have 10 different images so go ahead click Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. From here, you can do. Let's go to layer. I mean, timeline number two. Height one and visible two. Timeline three. Height one, visible three. Timeline four. Height one, visible four. Timeline five. 
and so on. Once you complete that, make sure you have this select and press shift on your keyboard, click and then select 0 0.1 second and then now you can preview our animation. It should look like that. Right? Now we want our character to do this kind of running animation so all we have to do is select all this layer here control T oh wait and make it a group and rename this as run Click and drag, oops, not wrong, and bring it here. Now we have this over here. Control T, right click, and flip horizontal. Enter. going to bring back the head because I need to do some adjustment go ahead press ctrl R on your keyboard to bring in your ruler and put this on top of the head one line on top of the head and one line just below the heel and then click the run animation I mean run folder ctrl T for transform and then we need this sa uh, sample to be as big as our character so shift key on your keyboard and click and drag until we have the image same big as our character almost there right it should be like this this kind of yeah okay I think this is nice and go ahead bring it behind and lock it all right in our next tutorial um we're going to turn our character to match the image reference one by one thanks for watching